Aboriginal TV Channel 4 celebrates National Reconciliation Week. Recognising our shared histories, cultures and achievements. When you acknowledge us as Aboriginal people, you don't lose your 230 years of history, you gain 50,000 years of history. Reconciliation. Well, to me it was really great, even though it was wet, it was solid. Well, what a fabulous day and event. Yeah, everybody came along. Great to see a lot of uh, Wadjulas here as well, as the uh, Noongar and uh, other people that were here. Fabulous. And I think um, the, the organising committee have done a brilliant job. And the, the key theme is let's work and walk together remember the past but let's make the future as good as we can make it. I think they're great messages to give. I enjoyed the walk even though it was raining. The water got on my face and my legs. All right today was awesome. I came to last year's reconciliation walk and that was really really good. Loved the crowd. Today was even more special even though it was raining you still had people that were really committed and wanted to come and enjoy uh, the sorry day and the walk over the bridge, I thought it was really lovely. Oh, it, was a, it was a good day, apart from the weather, but we can't control that, but yeah, um, no, it was a good day. So I did the walk for the first time, it was good to take part this year. It was great, it was great, it was time, you know, quite a few people turned out, which was lovely, and I think the fact that the people who, the weather was so bad that the people who came really wanted to be here, and they're, yeah, there was a very positive feel about it. It was, it was good. I am just really, really pleased about today. And even the weather just makes it so special because regardless of anything, there's nothing that can stop what is happening for the reconciliation and for the walking together. It's a significant moment, a significant thing to do. And what it means to me is that as a community leader, I have a responsibility to do whatever I can to influence a lot of people to understand why we need to do more reconciliation than what we've done. We've done a lot uh, in the past but we do need to do more into the future so reconciliation to me is walking alongside everybody walking alongside each other with the same goals, the same joys, the same challenges and the same opportunities. Our reconciliation means everyone coming together and acknowledging past history and working together to make a better history for the future. Understanding that different cultures can get together, knowing the history of the, of the Aboriginal people, um, working together in the future. We're all one people and that we can work together in the future, that's what reconciliation is. I guess it's everything. <laughs> It's just who we are as people, um, regardless of differences. Our value is really important, that our, our value as human beings is lifted up and uh, that there's no difference. And uh, we've just got to continue, like what Peter was saying today, you know, that there's, there's good and there's evil in this world and, and we've just got to really work to hold those good things together. Um, it means the community, you know, recognising the past so we can build a better future for you know, ourselves but mainly for the next generation. So. I suppose people have got to recognise Indigenous people a bit more than recognising everybody. Suppose. And it's taking a step forward and not back. Yeah. It's all part of healing because it's got to get to that stage of healing and everybody can move on. Some people are still finding it hard to come with the terms of all of this stuff. But once they do, they can move on, and everybody can help them move on. Because I haven't, I'm not a stolen generation, but I've sympathised with them because I've had family taken away too. Yeah, I mean, it's a good thing. And if they talk about it, it doesn't make it so hard for them to deal with the issues that, you know, it's like that. from stolen generation myself. So it affects us all, really. Yeah. And that's what the reconciliation is all about. Yeah. On the road to healing. 
and I mean, in this day and age, we can't discriminate against anybody because all us Nyungas are married to Wajalus and all, and vice versa, so we got to get along, <laughs> regardless, eh? Yeah. <laughs> and look forward to next year as well. So this is an annual event, so we encourage everyone to save this date every year, 26th of May, the start of Reconciliation Week. Aboriginal TV Channel 4, celebrating National Reconciliation Week. Reconciliation.